In this video, we're going to be diving into one of the most iconic and well-known fingerstyle guitar patterns, Travis Picking. Now, Travis Picking is that specific pattern that's used in songs like Dust in the Wind. It's not like normal finger picking where you're using your thumb, index, middle, and ring. Normally with Travis picking on guitar, you're only using your thumb, index, and middle finger. To start learning the Travis picking technique, you first need to understand that it's really based around your thumb. So let's say we're going to play a Travis picking pattern along with the C chord. The first thing that you're normally going to do is start by picking that bass note. So you start by just using your thumb and picking that bass note up. So what I want you to do is just get comfortable with that C chord and rotating your thumb between the fifth and the fourth strings. And notice how the thumb kind of keeps that steady rhythm going. That's what's very common in Travis picking music. Now I'm gonna show you how to take that alternating bass and turn it into a Travis picking pattern. There's hundreds of Travis picking patterns you can play. Here's one of the most common ones. So let's take that same chord, let's keep that alternating bass going, and after we play the thumb the first time, we'll play our middle finger on the second string. Is we're gonna add in our first finger after we play the fourth string. So this is an example of a Travis picking pattern. We have that thumb that's playing the fifth and the fourth strings. Our middle finger plays the second and our index plays the third. You can then take that pattern and then just move it to a bunch of different chords. The only thing that usually changes is what note you're playing at the beginning. Because over chords like your G chord, now your bass is actually on that sixth string. So when you're picking that, now you're going to be picking this to start it. So let's say we had a basic chord progression with C, G, and F. We'd start just by using our thumb on those bass notes to that F. Now let's add in the rest of the notes and see how it changes. You can really kind of get complicated with Travis picking. You can see here, now I'm actually adding in my ring finger. This is more finger style guitar, but it's just a bunch of different ways you can make your Travis picking sound better. You know, let's look at another Travis picking pattern. I want you to try to actually do this yourself if you can, if you have some basic guitar skill. The only two chords we're gonna be playing are the C major and the A minor. So these are the two chords we're playing, C major and A minor. And we're just gonna be switching between these two chords throughout this demonstration. So what I want you to do is start by putting your thumb on the fifth string your index on the third and your middle on the second. And this is kind of a common way you're gonna be placing your fingers when it comes to Travis picking. With your left hand, place down that C chord, third finger, second finger, first finger. Now start just by getting comfortable playing your thumb on the fifth string. But do not move your first and second fingers. You want to keep them there because in the future, you're gonna be picking those specific strings. So get comfortable. When you pick with your thumb, you really wanna pick in to your fingers. See, I'm picking into my fingers. Okay, once you get comfortable with this, then add that fourth string. One, two, three, four. One, two, three, four. Notice how I'm not stopping the string. I want it to rain as much as possible. Okay, and like I said, do not move your first and second fingers. Notice how they're just staying there. Okay. Now what we're going to do is we're going to when we play our thumb, we're gonna play our middle finger at the same time. This is difficult. You might have to pause the video and work on this. So, like this. So now we're just doing this. Get comfortable with that. And then after we play them both together, we're gonna to play our index on the third. This is just another basic Travis picking pattern. Like this. Middle, index, thumb. Middle, index, thumb. Notice how each finger gets that string, right? Your middle finger's playing the second, your index is playing the third. So we have middle, index, thumb. 
And now we're gonna add one more thing which is gonna make this even better, which is after we play our thumb for the second time, we're gonna go back to our index. So we're gonna go middle, index, thumb, index. Middle, index, thumb, index. Now here's one cool thing you can do with your left hand, is you can actually add in different melody notes like this. This is what you see in Dust in the Wind. Just add in different melody notes. Fourth finger, we're going to take it off. And you can change it a lot more. A lot of people do changes with other strains. It's not always the melody. Okay, now we're going to switch to the A minor chord. Notice how it's the same. Same pattern with your right hand. The only thing that changes is what chord you're playing. So we're going to do this four times. One. left hand. This is kind of like the dust of the wind. And now you can change it a bunch of different ways. So now I'm kind of doing a similar pattern, but now I'm just doing the thumb and the middle finger twice. There's a whole bunch of different ways you can change Travis picking, but the main idea is that you're playing with your thumb, your index, and middle finger. If we were going to look at the song Dust in the Wind and play it in more of a finger style version, what we would do is we'd use our ring finger as well. So we would use our thumb, our index, our middle, and our ring finger instead of just our thumb, our index, and our middle. First, I'm gonna do the normal Travis picking style, which is what we did. Notice how I'm using my index in my middle finger. Now this is gonna be the finger style version. So I'm gonna start with my thumb, my index, my middle, and my ring fingers laid out. So now my thumb's only playing the fifth string versus rotating between the fifth and the fourth. Versus this, we're doing this. Notice the difference. Okay, so that is how you Travis pick on guitar. You use your thumb, your index, and your middle fingers. Now, if you're interested in actually learning how to Travis pick on guitar and want some extra help from us here at Acoustia, then I want you to check out the comments or the description for our popular Travis picking programs that we have on guitar that have helped people all over the world of all ages and skill levels. One of our more popular programs with Travis picking is our Travis pick in 20 days program, which is all about getting Travis picking your first four songs on guitar. Now, this is a complete beginner program. We also have Travis Picking Pro if you're more of an advanced player. I hope you enjoyed this video. Make sure to subscribe for more videos like this on how to get better at guitar. And I look forward to seeing you in a new video very soon.